Hello parents, today we're going to do our numbers. We're going to do numbers and counters. We're going to focus on learning of the sequence and the quantity of our numbers. What we have here is just simple small square papers that are made. You just simply get white paper, make small squares and write the numbers on it. Okay, so what we want here is our children to be able to put the numbers in sequence. Sequence meaning they're in the correct order. One, two, three, four, and five. So that's what we want our children to do first. Okay, and another thing, we want them also to be able to recognize the numbers, even if they're not put in the correct order. We want them to be able to recognize that, oh, okay, this is three, this is five. This is one, etc. Okay, first, the first number we have number one. one. So take one and put it here for me, please. There we go. And then what comes after one? Two. 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 Good. And what comes after two? Three. Three. We want them to be repeating it over and over again. What comes after three? Four. Great stuff. What comes after four? Five. Five. This is one of the exercises that we do at school. The numbers and counters. It's um, perfect. Even at home, you can do it yourself. It's easy. It's convenient. Uh, and what we have here, this would, would call it our counters. What I took is just normal color paper and made into made them into small squares. So if you've got color paper, perfect. If you've got um, even just normal white paper, you can color on top of it and make small squares. This will be used as our counters. Oh. This is the quantity that will be used to match the numbers. Okay, which number is this? One. one. So we're going to put one counter. Put one counter here for me. There we go. Beautiful. Next number, what do we have here? Two. two. So we're going to put two counters. When you're introducing this activity to them, just um, let them repeat after you as they count the counters in. One. And two there we go which number do we have here three, three. one, one. Two. two three three can we put it over here beautiful which number is this one four, four. let's go one, one. Two. two so what we want for them is that once you introduce it you can reintroduce it the following day and then reinforce it. And let them do this until they are comfortable and doing it independently. We are not in any hurry. We, as um, a Montessori school, we encourage that we follow the pace of the child. Okay, what is this one? Five. five. So we're going to put five one, counters there. Two. two three. Four. Okay, we need one more here. Yeah, because it's four counters here. We need one more to make it a five. There we go, right here. So this is an exercise we call the numbers and counters. There we go, five. We can do this over and over again. It's just a simple, easy way that you can get your little one busy and not fall behind with their numbers. So this is called the numbers and counters. Thank you very much, parents.